If you are new to the KDP and if you think that I am trying a lot of things but nothing is working, maybe the cover is the problem, right? Maybe you are not good at designs. Maybe you do not know what kind of fonts you should choose or whatever the reason could be which relates to your cover, okay? So hello everyone, this is Priyanka Dube here. If you are new to the channel, please go ahead and support my channel. Although it's my small channel, but I'm putting a lot of efforts to give you the best knowledge uh, that possible from my end. So today we are going to talk about uh, how I create cover. See, there are a lot of ways through which I create cover, but in this video, I'm going to tell you the easiest way. And in the upcoming videos uh, on this channel, I'm going to discuss everything about how I do my covers as well. Okay, so let's get started. So what you need is only one tool that is Canva. I do all my design things, whether for thumbnails or like for my uh, KDP everything I do only in this platform. So if you do not have any account with this Canva Go ahead and uh, click the link in the description of the Canva and you can just sign up. Okay So what I do is you have to go into the Canva and then you have to create a design like right So we have to search the templates first of all. So I will go ahead and I will search book cover Canva gives you a lot of features. So yes, you can play around so while uh, once you will go to the book covers templates, you can see you will be provided the free ones like this and you will be provided the pro one like this, like it, you have to pay to use such kind of templates. But uh, before starting uh, and before starting uh, the covers, I would like to make one thing very clear that do not just go ahead and do not copy this and do not just change uh, the fonts and we are good to go no make the necessary changes because if everyone is going to do like that you your account uh, may be on to the risk because the covers would be same everything would be same and amazon will not like it right so make sure that on every cover that you are going to create using these covers make sure that you leave your own print make sure you leave your own style into that okay so without wasting much time let's get into this so let's suppose i want to create a cover and here you can see these are the pro these are the free i will start with the free one customize this template you will go ahead and you will start customizing it let's suppose i want to create this uh, as a 2022 journal or whatever it is or i can just write anything the book you are creating you can write the title over here so let's suppose i'm i'm uh, writing uh c c creature c creature coloring book it is an example right so this is my heading that is my title of the book because this things looks like the signature that's why i just picked up the title and i will put it like this if you want to change the fonts you can obviously go ahead and you can use uh, the fonts as you want for now it is good uh, if you want to make the effects obviously you can select it and you can go into the effects and you can curve it you can splice it whatever you want to do you can do it okay so i am not uh, doing those things i'm just giving you an example so yeah okay i think it looks good so now what you have to do is you you can change the colors you can add more colors uh, or you can uh, add more elements into it like if this uh, this element is of orange color i can go ahead and i can change it into something like this or i can change into sea green uh, or you can go ahead and you can change the face uh, position over here or what i can do is i can go into the elements and i can search for like ocean okay we are just taking an example and now you can see that we got some uh, elements from here. So if you want to put it, you can put it like this one. This one is free. 
so i will go ahead and i will put it i will remove this out and i will put this one sorry i will put this one over here okay similarly if i want to put another thing i can do that as well like this one is pro so obviously you have to upgrade your free canva account but if you do not want to do that you can use the free elements over there right so i will simply go ahead and i will select more things from here uh, let's suppose i want to go for like c creatures i'm just putting it and i'm just i just want to see so you can see there are a lot of things over here this one looks good to me what i can do is i can remove this one and i can put it like this i can rotate it i can enlarge it and like this also if you if your a pen name is another thing you can simply re remove it or if you write if you want to write some another things like 35 pages you can write it like this as well okay and if your pen name is like my pen name for suppose if your pen name is uh, your name you can put it over here so let's suppose you want to put c designs c colorings or c designs i'm just taking an example but make sure that you put your uh, pen name over here or if you do not want to put it simply remove it okay and also i can go ahead and i can change something from here like if i want to change the fish i can just uh, do the fish and i can see uh, what kind of pictures they are providing me and i can use like this and if i want to change the colors i can go ahead and i can change the color according to my choice let's just see how i am uh, rotating it to change the colors so yeah okay if i want to change this color the gray, this yellow one i can go ahead and i can change the color uh, you have to give some time to see like what color is uh, working best for you i am just taking an example so i'm not putting so much of attention over here but you can put your time into it to make it look good it is yellow if i want to uh, take it like something like orangish i can do that and if i want to change something else i can do that as well so i think you are getting the idea that what i exactly i am doing over here i think it looks good to me um, if it doesn't look good to you you can go ahead and make the necessary changes or you can go into the templates you can look for other options that you have over here if you have the pro version you can go ahead and use this and if you have free if you want to use the free one you can go ahead and use that too okay so once i have decided my uh, design i will go ahead and i will uh, just download it in the jpg form and after downloading it i will simply upload it okay now i have uploaded it now what next i have to decide is i have to choose the book cover size okay to choose the book cover size for kdp i will simply go ahead and i will simply write book cover uh, template book cover template over here after using the book cover template sorry here i will write kdp once i'm done i will simply go ahead and i will calculate the cover so the binding type is my paperback interior type is black and white paper type is white paper upon uh, paste transaction is left to right measurements units is inches interior trim size is now you have to choose the size that you are looking for if you are looking for 6 into 9 you can do that but right now i am choosing the standard size that is 8.5 into 11 inches and number of pages is let's suppose uh, i have 100 i am just taking an example 
once i'm done i will calculate the dimensions so you can see that what is the bleed uh, what is the full cover and all those things and uh, once you are done with all these things you will go ahead and un download the template once you have downloaded the template what you will do is you will simply uh, open it up so once you have downloaded the image uh, of the template you can see uh, the image that you have gotten over here so the overall dimension is 17.47 uh, so i will go ahead and i will create a design like this and first of all i will upload this image into the canva so i have already done that for you guys so i will go ahead and i will create a new design the custom design our uh, our dimension was 17.475 17.475 seven five sorry i have to convert it into inches so yeah 17.475 uh and what's the other one uh 11.250 so 11.250 okay now i will create a new design once i have created that new design you can see that i have exactly the same uh, cover template that kdb suggest and i have already uploaded this one yeah so i will go ahead i will just extend it to the size and then i have to create the spine of the book that is this part so for the creating the spine you will go ahead in the elements and you will just select lines and shapes into the lines and shapes select uh, just a square one and just convert it into a spine like this and extend it okay you can decrease the size like this once you are done you can remove this up and now what you will do is you will go ahead and you will uh, just put your design that i have already downloaded and you will extend it okay once you have extended it this is our front cover and this is our back cover if you want to uh, put it like only like this like not the image what you will do is you will simply go ahead and you will remove this out and you will download this image and you will upload it like a back cover here but i am just uh, i'm just going to put the color over here i'm not going to use the design so let it be now i had i had uh, uh, discussed earlier that whatever is the title of the book goes to the spine of the book right so what i will do is i will go ahead and i will just copy this one the title and then i will uh, put it into the spine so it's simply put it like this because i want to know exactly where i have to put it and i have to put it into this small white space okay i will take the text and then i will put my title over here and then i will reduce the size to like 10 or something like that size does not matter then just put it like this and rotate it 90 degree once you have rotated it go ahead and put it into this white space over here okay white space i think it is good i think it perfectly fits into this once you are done you will go ahead and remove this so now you got to see that you have exactly put the right text at the right place okay you can change the spine color as well like into like this you can choose this color or you can choose green color whatever suits you best or you can use it black color as well so once you are done you can see that this uh, image looks very pretty very good and it is captivating as well so this is how i create the covers this is one of my uh, 
ways through which i create the cover there are a lot of other ways as well so for now it is the free one it is the best one okay so i hope you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the video go ahead and support my channel and share with your people who want to earn a passive income and yeah comment uh, write down below share your thoughts like comment and thank you so much once again and i will see you in the next